It all started with a phone call. Hello? Yeah. You're kidding me. The dumpster's full? Is the food good? And flowers too? All right, I'm on it. You mean you want me to come now? Right now. Okay, I'll be there. Bye. Wow, what a rush. I can't wait to show you what I just got done doing. Oh, from Trader Joe's Dumpster. Trader Joe's Dumpster. The food waste is unreal. The adrenaline rush is so much fun. I can't wait. I can't wait to show you what it is. So what's it really like to dumpster dive? What's it really like? So what's it really like to dumpster dive? What's it really like to have food that came from a dumpster? Well, it's pretty exciting. I can see what all of the fuss is about. All of these dumpster videos. We're getting so much food out of the dumpster. It's an adrenaline rush of your car stepping up and getting all of the food for free and quickly getting back in your car again. <laughs> it is so much fun. It's something that you just don't know what it's like until you experience it for yourself. So step inside my house and I'll show you what I got today. I'll be the first one to admit to you, my heart is beating rather quickly yet. It's a little bit of a rush. You go in, you grab a bunch of food, you get out. It's a little bit something different and so unique. But let me tell you, I can't begin to explain to you what it's like to get free food. Trader Joe's, everything came from Trader Joe's. And their flowers, beautiful flowers, breads, all kinds of breads, vegetables, I'm going to blanch and freeze, produce, ah, so excited. I am so excited. I hope you're half excited as I am to see this because it is amazing. So. Let's get started with what I got. I'm putting everything on the table because it's so much stuff. So, we got a plant, <laughs> and we got two gallons of milk. We got all kinds of flowers. We got all of these flowers, and look how pretty they are. I'm going to dehydrate these and make potpourri. I got two big banana boxes full of stuff for free. The stuff doesn't expire until today, so the rolls will be great. So all of these breads. I got some cranberry raisin pecan bread. I got a container of fruit that was sealed, and I actually tried one of them, and it seemed really good. It doesn't expire until tomorrow. Salads, I got a whole bunch of salads more bread, then I got a whole bunch of broccoli, some more flowers, some bananas, a whole bunch of tomatoes, so I'm going to get everything out of here and then I'll pan my camera and show you. So this is box number one, so what I was doing was just grabbing, grabbing, <laughs> grabbing and putting everything in my banana box. So let's go and show you what I got in banana box two. Box two, more bread, more broccoli. I'm going to work on it today right away. All kinds of fruits and vegetables in here in the box. Some cookies, more breads, some avocados. Honestly, don't know how much this would cost me if it was new. Got some bagels. So the breads I can easily put in the freezer. I got some bananas. And look at the beautiful roses. 
$6.99, people, I got for free that came from a dumpster. I'm going to dehydrate them. So, let me go ahead, put the, all the vegetables in a bowl, and I'll show you everything I got that's spread out on the table. All out of a dumpster. Here we go, everybody. This is free food that came out of a dumpster. Take a look at this. Times this by every single day. Look at all the food that is being wasted in the United States of America. Absolutely intolerable. Bananas, tomatoes, they're just everywhere. Oh, the bread. This bread doesn't expire till, this bread doesn't expire till February the 20th. This expires tomorrow. This expires tomorrow. Look at this broccoli. Beautiful broccoli. Not a thing wrong with this stuff. The milk expired today. So I'm going to open it up and then I'll try to freeze it. The vegetables are going to be dehydrated. It's just really hard to imagine. There's people that dumpster dive. You know, they go out every day and find free food. You know, this is just such a rush to get all of this food. This is food that I can use. This is food that was going to be thrown away. This is Trader Joe's food, which is a very highly sought after food. All of this, my friends, would have been thrown away. Unbelievable. What's the point of all this food if I'm gonna let it go to waste? So I'm gonna share with you what I'm gonna do with all this bread. So the bread, what you wanna do is you always wanna have it double wrapped. So we are gonna double wrap our bread and we're gonna freeze it. The two packs of rolls expired today. What I'm gonna do is I'm going to make cubes out of these and we're gonna make homemade croutons. So I took another bag and I'm double wrapping all of this bread. Because we wanna make sure we keep as much moisture in our bread in the freezer as we can. That way, when we get it out of the freezer, it's just as fresh as the day we put it in. Now, some of this bread doesn't even expire till next week. So, none of this bread is expired. Some of it expired today, but none of it is old. But I want to take care of it right away, what we're not going to eat. Jewish bread and I was so blessed to get two of these right now I have my water boiling because I'm blanching all of that broccoli my flowers I chose flowers that can dehydrate very pretty to make potpourri the cranberry raisin pecan bread is probably going to be my favorite so I'm going to leave one of these out to eat right away. We have the Lucky 7 grain seeded bread. This is artesian bread that doesn't even expire until the 20th. So we got quite a few days before that's even expired. But the fresher your bread is when you freeze it, the fresher it's going to be when you get it out of the freezer. The water is boiling. Now we're going to go ahead and we're going to put our broccoli in it. So we're going to blanch this broccoli for three minutes. I'm going to cut some of the stems as well. I'm not going to cut the real woody part. I'm just going to cut the more tender part. In the cold water and now what we do is I'm just taking them out and put it in its bags. So this will give me two more meals. I'm just so thankful that I was able to find some vegetables and some fruit as well. Now the fruit needs to be eaten today, the, the watermelon and the cantaloupe. But I tried the kiwi and I tried some of it, it was really good yet. So I'm gonna put this in the bags and then we're gonna cut up the peppers and I'm going to dehydrate the peppers. 
because they need to get used up as well. Bread box is full. My freezer is full. We have enough of milk to last us at least a week. Hopefully it lasts longer. I may freeze some of it. All from thrown away food. <laughs>